one very crucial penalty kick which has now gone down in history as a moment that we would all want to relive. The same as ladies and gentlemen, former player of the Black Stars, former in the 20 FIFA World Cup winner, and a former player of the other national team. Put your hands together for Emmanuel Ajiman Bedou. As a gentleman of the club, I'm here to represent you. All right. Thank you. We are grateful to the organizers. Thank you very much. Thank you. So let's put our hands together for him. And now to the next set of awards. Last award of the evening for the women's team coach of the year. Please keep your phone going. He's been consistent. He's gotten the results that he deserves. ceremony of this nature. Even if I'm not nominated, I want to come around so that it will inspire me to always work harder. So once again, I thank everybody for their support. To have the most vibrant club in Ghana is a big deal in this day and age. And we're here to award this club. But first of all, the Normans. Social media. The most vibrant club on social media award is presented to the club which has had the most trends and consistent interaction with football fans on social media. The nominees are Nations FC, Summertex, Dreams FC, And the winner is Dreams FC. Let's put our hands together for Dreams FC. I'm here to present the Future Star Award and the nominees. Award. This award is given to the best performing Ghanaian footballer below the age of 20 for the season under review. The nominees are Abdul Aziz Issa. Dreams FC, Jerry Efriye, Thoughts FC, Theophilus Ayanga, Third World FC, Mark Mensa Kagawa, Atram Divise. And the winner is Abdul Aziz Isa. Dreams FC. 
Isn't this amazing? Ladies and gentlemen, one more time, a big round of applause. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Winfred Dormund. I am the assistant coach at Dreams FC. And it's my greatest honor to pick up this award on behalf of my player, Abdul Aziz Issa, who unfortunately could not make it here because of travel. But Aziz is making a promise through me that this award is going to push him to more higher heights. Aziz Abdul Isa is grateful. Thank you. Good evening, everyone. I'm here tonight to present the award for the good club of the year. A special position in a lowly position in football. And the nominees. <laughs> this award is given to the best performing Ghanaian goalkeeper for the season under review. The nominees are Benjamin Asari, Great Olympics, 13 goals conceded in 30 league games. Emmanuel Kobe, Bofor Quartano, 11 goals conceded in 28 league games. Felix Che, Midyama CS, 11 goals conceded in 23 games. Kofi Ba, Sanatex, 12 goals conceded in 25 league games. <laughs> Let's see. And the winner. Kofi Ba. Congratulations, Kofi Ba, for winning the goalkeeper of the year. A very lonely position indeed. Congratulations to As you. As defined by Fatal Dauda. Not surprising that this man, together with his teammates, won the coveted title of the Ghana Premier League. Congratulations once again to you, Kofi Ba. Ladies and gentlemen, one more big round of applause. It's not easy for me, I don't know what to say. Um, I'll give thanks to God. Second to my like my technical team, playing body and my coaches. God bless Mr. Richard Isenchi. Thanks to goes to some of the supporters. I will see some before in my life in Ghana here yeah. that we have much grateful supporters in Ghana here. Yeah. I'm proud to be Samates family. Thank you. Congratulations. Let's put our hands together for good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I'm here to present the Women Footballer of the Year um, with my colleague from the UNESCO Ghana Commission. The nominees. This award is given to the best Ghanaian performing lady for the season under review. The nominees are Comfort Yebowa, Ampim Dakwa Ladies, Ophelia Amponsa, Ampim Dakwa Ladies, Mukarama Abdullai, Hazakas Ladies, Jennifer Kankam, ZFC, Egypt, Bridget Edu, Tut FC, Egypt. And the winner is Jennifer Kakaiwa. Congratulations. Oh. Women's footballer of the year. Let's put our hands together for her. As she joins us on stage. Congratulations, Jennifer.
the doings of the Lord. Thank you everyone for this opportunity. This is a dream come true. I thank God for these days. I would like to thank my father, General Gordon Nochuga, Pastor Ajeman Bedu, Ebenezer Alote, Eric Asumani Yafe, my family, my fans, faith ladies, ZFC, prayer embassy, Coach Rege. God bless you all. Thank you. Thomas and the Rock of Gibraltar. This award is given to the player of judged by fans to have scored the best goal in the season under review. The nominees are Salim Adams, Hart vs. Karela. Salim Adams, he wants to shoot. It's a powerful drive and it's a wonder goal. This is magnificent. What time is substitution paid off? That's a world-class goal by Salim Adams. He had the confidence to shoot, and this one was really, really amazing. Mohamed Kudus, Sunday versus West Ham. Fatal Isahaku, Leicester City versus Bournemouth in the FA Cup. Mohamed Kudus, Manchester City versus Leicester. Emmanuel Kayeke, Sanitex versus Ijoma FC. Bernard Mensah, Al Tai versus Al Ahli. Aziz Isa, Dreams versus Academica.
Good evening, everyone. Um, first of all, um, I would like to thank each and every one of you that put in the effort to make sure that this amazing event happened today. Um, I'm happy to be awarded for the Goal of the Year Award, but um, congrats to all the nominees because I think everyone put in their effort. And this is a testament of hard work and dedication. Big congrats to all my teammates for the support and all the team around me and my family. Thank you. part of the new generation one of my aim is to increase the unity and the love between us and this season in as much as we are competing for the award um, it's a very healthy competition and then he has pushed me a lot this season and I've pushed him a lot too um, I've told him this already but in front of everyone I want to use this opportunity to tell him how proud I am of his journey and how far he has come and what he has done this season at Leicester. And this is a source of motivation for me and him and all the upcoming players coming up. And there has been a lot of legends here. Um, I can't mention names, but I want to use this opportunity to thank all of them because everything they have done in the past years has paved the way for us, the young ones, to get here today. So our responsibilities also paved the way even clearer for the upcoming ones and then pass the torch backwards. Thank you, everyone. Have a nice day. Ladies and gentlemen, the Footballer of the Year here at the Ghana Football Awards 2024, Kudus Mohamed. Put your hands together one more time.